Hi everyone. So today I have my July Scentsy Club that I wanna share as well as the July Whiff Box. So let me just open it up. I got this in the mail yesterday, but I didn't have time to like film and open it up with you all. So I decided to wait and I've been so excited because I wanted to open it all day today, but um, I'm filming this now after work. So, okay, we have the invoices. Oh my gosh, this is a big invoice. Um, oh yeah, so this month of July, like it says, we are getting a free scent pack. And I remember hearing about that, I think in a Scentsy video I was watching. They always stuff it with paper. So we have the whiff box right here. And then, gosh, this is heavy. And then the bars in the separate box as well. It came in kind of a big box. I was surprised when I saw it. So um, let's first do the whiff box. I love getting the whiff box. I think actually this box looks smaller than some of my other past whiff boxes I've gotten. Um, and I love reusing the boxes as well. Um, I did watch spoilers, of course, like I can never wait, but this is what it looks like. Whiff box, a celebration in pink. So that's what it looks like. And that's the inside. This, um, this is always my half price item. So I get the whiff box. I think it's like $15. So such a good deal. And I love trying out different Scentsy products. So I personally have really been enjoying the whiff box. I've been getting it now. This is my third whiff box. I get it every other month with my Scentsy Club. So that's what it looks like in there. I think this is the first time I've gotten like one of these pouches this year. Um, so I see, I actually just watched Hannah's video the other day. I have never had a room spray from Scentsy before. So you get this room spray in pink sugarberry mint. I have this pink sugarberry mint in a wax bar, which I haven't used yet. I don't mind it, but it's not a favorite, but I am really excited to try out a new product for me. So the room spray. You also get Pink Sugarberry Mint Car Bar, which again is a new product to me. I've never had the Car Bar before. So excited to try that. Um, okay, then the last thing in here under the little um, like worm things is Washer Whiffs in Cloudberry Dreams. They send a Cloudberry Dreams, what is it called, dish soap? in I think the March Whiff box. And I really enjoyed it. I really liked it. I thought it smelled kind of apple-y. Let's smell. Ooh, yeah, that smells super good. But like everyone else, for some reason, I feel like the wax, I don't like as much as other products. Like I feel like this smells super good and I'm excited to try it out in the laundry product. But for some, re for some reason, the wax comes off a lot more like powdery rose heavy to me. Um, but yeah, washer whiffs, and then let's see what's in here. How do I... Oh. Okay, so in here we have this freezer pack. We have, so both of these wax bars I think I've had. Yeah, I think I've had them. So we have pink rhubarb sugar, which I really like. It's a good summer scent. I think it's going away. Yeah, it's super good. It kind of reminds me of pink lemonade. And then we have prickly pear and agave. I'm glad that pink rhubarb sugar came because I was debating whether I wanted to get another bar or not. Um, I ended up not doing it. So now I have one bar in my collection plus this one. And I think that's perfect for the remainder of the summertime. And then, hmm, yeah, prickly pear and agave. Um, this smells kind of like a green... There's a greenness in here. I like it. I think it's really good. I think I've warmed my one bar of prickly pear and agave. So I have one more in my collection now that I just received because of the whiff box. Let's see. I think there's a little crack on the side there, but no worries at all. But um, yeah, I'm excited to have another one for the summer. 
And then the last thing in here is the Glacier Water scent, which I guess in here is like the scent of the month, but I kind of don't, where should I open? Ooh, that smells good. It smells masculine to me. I don't want to open it like too much because I don't think this is like resealable, but um, it smells masculine, kind of like cologne a little bit. So because it's kind of open, I'll probably just pop in, into a bathroom warmer or something. So yeah, so we got, like I said, the sample, two wax bars, the washer whiffs, the room spray, and the car bar. So yeah, super fun. Definitely worth the $15. Then let's open up the bars that I got. Let me know, would you guys want me to do like a club edit video for my club that will process early September. I was thinking maybe I'll just add scents, you know, in my club as I want, but I was thinking maybe I won't remove any and we could kind of like go through my club and make edits together, um, maybe like late August. Usually I just add and remove things whenever, but I could wait so we could do that together if you guys want. Um, so here's the free scent pack. Coconut lemongrass. I can kind of smell it through here. I definitely, act, I smell a lot of coconut, honestly, but it is wrapped in plastic. So we'll have to see when I actually go to unpackage this. But yeah, I will probably put this in like my sock drawer or like a dresser drawer. Um, Cause I don't have like a, sensey buddy or anything to put this in but i think this will be nice for like a dresser drawer like i said so i will do that so super cool they're sending that for free then we have this huge pack right here with the wax bars let's see it is 84 degrees out today so nice that they're doing the the cooling bag all right, so there's more ice packs. This is a big club and I definitely am gonna try to cut it down for September, but let's just go through. So I'm gonna try to go through pretty quick. I'm not gonna go in depth with like scent notes or anything of the ones that are repeat scents that I've gotten before. So I got, I got red, I love red. The whole Chase Rainbows collection for me was a hit. The only one I didn't personally like was the blue one. And it's not that I didn't like it. I I thought it was nice, but it's just, to me, that one wasn't club worthy. So I'm just trying to find my other Chase Rainbows so I can show them, but I don't see them. Okay, here's one. So we also have yellow. We have green, and then I should have orange, yes. And then here's the orange. I really like them all. Honestly, I think I'll just keep them in my club for now because I really enjoy them. My favorite ones are probably these three. And I do love the green as well, which is why it's in my club, but I really like the red, orange, and yellow. Okay, this one is also a repeat that I've had in all my Scentsy clubs, which is the Valentine's Day collection. It's Love and You're the One. I did remove, um, what was it? I removed Together Forever. That one was a little bit too like powdery floral, but these two are really, really great. I love them. Um, these are also repeats that I have in my club. I, where did the other one go? I'm sorry if this is like crinkly to the bag. Okay, so these two from the like Disney collection, Dumbo and Totally Mini. Um, so basically everything I've shown so far, the Chase Rainbows collection and the Valentine's Day collection and Dumbo, these are all like bring, no, never, what is it called? Always get my bars. So you can't get these ones anymore, but Totally Mini is still available. 
I believe. I don't think this is like limited edition anymore. But um, yeah, so, so far I have this in my club still. Yeah, we might just have to do a club edit together because I'm like, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep totally mini, but everything else I've shown, I think I'm gonna keep in my club. Um, we have Very Bright. So I've always had this one in my club. I think it's a really nice, like true, to me, true like blue raspberry candy kind of a scent. I feel like a lot of vendor wax blue raspberry it smells really light, like I can't really smell it, but that's like spot on to like, to me, like a blue raspberry Jolly Rancher candy. It's really nice. We have Sparkling Magnolia. I think this is an always get your bar now. I don't think they have it anymore. I can't remember for sure though. This was from the Mother's Day collection. It's super, super pretty, but it is light. So you really need to do this in a small room. Otherwise it'll probably get lost and you won't smell it. We have the bring back my bars that I ended up adding to my club. So the first one is love you very much. And what I want to say is all these bring back my bars. I need to test out now. So I had a Scentsy like bring back my bar video from June. Since then, the only bring back my bar I warmed was the blueberry pancakes, which I didn't add to my club. Everything else now I think is a duplicate. So I need to test it out prior to my club processing in September. So love you very much. Forever yours. I'll have the scent notes in my description box. Um, summer rain. Berry of paradise. Love and Happiness, Simply Irresistible, Cotton Candy Cookie. This is the only one from the Bring Back My Bar that honestly, even before warming, I think I might cut out of my club. Again, I'm not gonna make any cuts until I warm, but it's just super light. And mainly what I get is like a raspberry scent, like kind of a cotton candy raspberry. So I'm not sure. Um, Flower Child. Um, what else is there? Cutie Pie Cupcake. Lemon Coconut Chiffon. Is that all from the, oh, an Inner Peace. I think those might be all of my Bring Back My Bars. Um, I need to test out Clementine Cupcake, so this is another one in my club, versus Cutie Pie Cupcake. Right off the bat, I think I prefer Clementine Cupcake, but we'll see. I feel like Clementine Cupcake didn't have the best longevity, but I do like it. I think it does really good for like a few hours and then it kind of fizzles out. I haven't actually warmed Cutie Pie Cupcake yet, so I can't really judge it, but I do want to compare them and have one of them in my club. I don't think I need both. Um, I also have Hey Tiger Lily, which I've gotten in every club. It's the reason I started a club because I really love this scent. It's just so good and such a strong, nice, pretty, perfumey floral. This one is no longer available. I think it's now and always get my bar. I added in red, white, and berry pie. So now I have three of these because I didn't actually warm my, was this a June? No, was this June or July scent of the month? I can't remember, but I think I'll try to warm one of my bars now. I usually try to let them sit a little bit, but this one right off the bat honestly smells pretty strong of cherry. So I think it'll be a strong one. So I'll definitely warm my bar of that to test out. And then blueberry cheesecake, I love. I'm definitely keeping this in my club. I think they have a brick of this. If I ever get sick of getting the whiff box as my half price item, I'd consider getting that in a brick. We have Luna, which is so, so pretty, but it is a permanent wax bar. So I think in my next club, I'll probably remove it. But it is really pretty. It's a really nice scent. I think anyone would like it. 
Again, Luna to me is a little on the light end, but in a small room, I think it does fine. Um, these two haven't been in my club. I added them in, but I have had them before. So I added Amazon Rain at the last moment before my club process because I loved how it performed on warm. Like, I don't feel like I'm super impressed with it on cold, but on warm, I just feel like it's so pretty. So that's in my club. And then 100 Acre Woods. I've had this before. It's just a really nice comforting... To me, it almost comes off as like a lavender comforting cozy scent, but I don't think lavender is actually in here. Um, oh, it's so pretty. It's um, Cotton Blossom, Wild Jasmine, and Sweet Cozy Vanilla. But like I said, it kind of gives me lavender vibes. Maybe that's partly because of the purple color. Okay, then the rest of these I think are new scents that I kind of just added in to try them. Um, so the first one is Cucumber and Cactus Water. This is a summer fragrance that I'm assuming is going to go away. I have this from the Whiff Box that, what did it come in? A Scentsy Fresh, I think. And I think the Scentsy Fresh smells super good. So I just wanted to give this one a try. And yeah, it's nice. My husband likes those clean kind of watery, fresh scents. So I think he's really going to like it. We'll definitely have to give it a try and see how performance wise it does. And then Vanilla Waves. Again, I think this one's going away, but I just really wanted to try it out. Let's see. Ooh, that is pretty. Wait, I like this one way better than I thought I was going to. Because a lot of vanilla bakery scents from Scentsy I don't love. This is really good. I like it way better than sugar cookie because I think I had sugar cookie once I've had happy birthday I had like vanilla bean buttercream what other scents have I had I don't know but none of those I really liked I think vanilla bean buttercream I thought smelled a little play-doh-y sometimes vanilla wax can smell a little on the play-doh side this is really pretty I think people say it's kind of a a perfumey vanilla like body care vanilla but I actually think it to me it does smell kind of like a bakery edible vanilla like cupcake I don't know okay I like this I was thinking this was going to be a one-time ad for my club just just to try it out but then I was going to remove it but based off of how it smells on cold I think it smells super good I feel like performance wise it might do well at least it smells strong to me on cold so this might actually stay in my club because I think this one's going away um, at the end of July. Um, I just wanted to give it a try, start preparing myself for some fall scents. So I did get baked apple pie. This one isn't going away. I think it's staying. Oh, that's good. It's, um, it's spicier than I thought it was going to be. I think it'll be a good uh, fall scent. But because it's staying in the, the catalog, I think this will be like a one and done. Like I'll probably remove this from my club now just because I just wanted to give it a try. It's okay. Like I said, spicier than I thought it was going to be. There's something on the bottom that I don't love as much. But yeah, it's fine. This will be good for the fall time. So I'll just save it for then. And then the last one that I got that I feel like I hear a lot of people like this is already a, uh, always get my bar, I think. I think it already went away at the end of June, I believe. This is the NHL Fresh Ice. I thought my husband would probably like it. I think this is supposed to be like a mint scent. Um, let's see. Cold air and icy mint face off at full strength while a slap shot of sandalwood brings home the win. I don't usually like sandalwood, but any scent that I've gotten from Scentsy with sandalwood, I've actually really enjoyed. Um, and my husband likes sandalwood. Oh yeah, that's pretty. It's actually a really strong mint. Whoa, stronger than I thought. This is like a nose clearing mint. Wow. I think my husband's gonna like it. I think it's way stronger on the mint than like manly cologne. 
definitely a strong nose clearing mint so this will be great i think my husband will really like this so i think i'll probably keep this in my club for him but yeah that was everything i got yes it was a lot of bars so we will see i haven't made my decision yet but i'm thinking about splitting my club and having like the scents that i really want but don't necessarily need super frequently i'm thinking about moving them to quarterly and then having like a bi-monthly um yeah like a bi-monthly to be kind of my like random like new scents um new ads that i just want to try come a little bit more frequently and split it like maybe like I don't know, like six bars and six bars or 10 bars and 10, instead of having one huge club be like 35 bars. Like I think that's like, I'd rather split it up a little bit on the time frame, but we'll see. I haven't really decided if I wanna do that or not, but um, but yeah. I saw an email recently too from Sensi saying they were changing like the shipping. I think it's gonna be like a flat rate fee or something of the shipping, which actually makes me wanna split it even more now, so. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.